All right. Hello, everybody. Travis Chandler, Chandler Gaming, back with the next episode of Mass Effect 3. Everything's working good. All right. I know the auto save says, oh, you're on the Normandy. I always like to load the save that I do manually. And I like to save manually. That way then, I know where I'm loading up. I know what I'm doing, all that. But so, okay, last episode, um, we went to the Ardit Yachi uh, Monastery. And we ran into Samara. She had two more daughters who were Ardit Yachis. And turns out the Reapers were there to turn the Ardat Yachi into, um, Banshees. And so we ended up blowing up the monastery. So today, we are gonna, um, do some missions, I think. I'm thinking, and we're gonna, um, yeah, we're just gonna do missions, I think. Probably have to explore a little bit in the galaxies, but that's okay. See, we're good, we're getting there, we're getting there for the military strength. <laughs> started out as an alliance black op. Black ops always go bad. If you have to deny the action, it was a crappy action. Commander, Dr. Chuck was sent word that she'd like to speak with you down in the med bay. And why is that? The Crucible Project received some new tech from the Asari government. I'm glad they've decided to help the war effort. Everybody has to fight now, no matter how pretty you are. <laughs> I learned that the hard way. So why does Dr. Chalk was want to talk to us? We gave her her medical supplies. What the hell does she want now? Shepard? Remember our agreement? We'd open a bottle of Cerise Ice Brandy every year, and it's my turn to buy. But it hasn't been a year yet. Yes, well, something tells me we won't have the chance a few months from now, so... Indulge my impatience. You grab the glasses. I'll open the bottle. Damn right, Shepard's getting drunk. And Jeff says, Jack, Jacqueline, Subject Zero, sorry, but it's ma'am to me. I'd like to keep my Admiral Winky. Oh, Shepard. You know, I just realized. You've never called me by my first name. Well, neither of you. And I never will. You are Commander Shepard. Hero of the Citadel. Conqueror of the Collectors. Savior of the Galaxy. Using your first name just disrespects everyone you're fighting for. Alive or gone. <laughs> that makes no sense. Consider it a lady's prerogative, then. Come, let's have a toast. To a woman I'm proud to call my friend. I'm lucky to have you with me, Karen. And to you, dear friend. It is my great honor to share this journey with you. Commander Shepard. And good fortune to us all. I've learned my lesson this time. Even a Krogan couldn't match you drink for drink. <laughs> I'd like to keep my Admiral Winky. <laughs> 
Oh, Garrus is in the lounge. Okay, we'll check him out. See what he wants with Javik. Everybody was fighting the Rachni, trying to push them back through the relay. Finally, the Krogan were turned loose and stopped them. I see. But when the Krogan rebelled, we had to deploy the Genophage to stop them. It wasn't the only rebellion. A thousand years later, the Geth revolted against the Quarians. That was a whole other war. Then along came the humans. My own people tangled with them for a while, and now, to top it all off, we've got the Reapers. What about you? The Ouroboros fought the Densorim. The Andoromai conquered the Vanduma, and the Jatil turned against the Jah. So, I guess nobody really ever gets their act together. The Sinriel claimed to have found the path to eternal peace. What happened? The Ditika preferred war and wiped them out. <laughs> I hope you guys had alcohol. Some of the crew seem shocked by the monstrosities we have encountered. They haven't seen what the Reapers could corrupt after a hundred years. That was our war. Every battle conjured a new nightmare. Samara's the kind of soldier we need in this war. Nothing gets in her way. I just hope I'm not in her way someday. That woman means business. It's a brilliant tactic, when you think about it. But it's evil. When has that ever mattered in war? Yeah, but converting other life forms into Reapers? I can't wrap my head around that. Makes sense to me. It ensures you never run out of cannon fodder. Eliminates any local resistance. And for every soldier you add, your enemy loses two. The one you converted, and his buddy on the other side who can't pull the trigger on a friend. You sound like you admire them. Same way I admire a virus or a thresher maw. They've adapted perfectly to their situation. But the Reapers want to destroy us. And I have no intention of letting them. But if you don't respect your enemy's capabilities, you're in for one nasty surprise after another. Hey, Garrus is right. Garrus is right, man. Um. What the hell does Chief... What the hell does Adams want? We got him his thermal pipe. What the fuck does he want now? of that thermal pipe you got us. It went right, brilliant. Much better than we expected. I told you it would. It gets better. While interfacing through our ESO capacitors, our Miss Daniels here had an epiphany. I wouldn't go that far. She and Donnelly deduced some theoretical improvements to our capacitor design. Edie and I ran with it and documented our conclusions. Our core is too compact to apply our theories, but it could help the Crucible engineers. Give the word and they'll send the plans their way. Do it. Aye, aye. Well done, everyone. All right. Well, that was worth it. We did level up, so. What now? Crucible update from Ren. Oh, we're working. It's coming good. That's pretty much what she said. Taylor Jacobs, like, oh, um, oh, I'm just a gopher. So, yeah, Samara. Oh, I finished my business, and now I'm going to join up on the war. And um, the Asari to thank us for blowing up that um, Ardit Yachi monastery. Well, they're sending commandos to us.
Let me make sure Edie doesn't have anything to say. What are you doing, Edie? Monitoring reports of proton storms and other space weather. With the Reapers attacking the comm buoy systems, critical warnings may be lost. How bad are these storms? If we are warned, not bad. If we are not warned, very bad. Thanks for the info, Edie. Wait, what's this? Oh, the airlock? They actually made the airlock in this one. Huh. That's cool. I don't understand why they got rid of the damn um, armory. I, I don't understand that. I don't know why the Alliance got rid of the armory. Nice, we got both of them. Nice. Oh yeah, I got I got another upgrade too for from Glyph, don't I? Another bit of wreckage. And another bit of wreckage. Faster than light jumps. Sayonara, suckers! So we're ready to speak to the Quarians. But of course, we're going to go and search the galaxy here. There it is. There must not be anything here. But we're going to dock with the Envoy ship. Commander Shepard, a pleasure to see you again. Though I wish it were under better circumstances. I had hoped for your support in the fight against the Reapers. What's going on? Seventeen days ago, with precision strikes on four Geth systems, the Quarians initiated the war to retake our home world. Which was a clear violation of our agreement with the Council to avoid provoking the Geth. A treaty violation is nothing compared to recovering our home world and advanced AI technology. I'm glad to hear that you're finally reclaiming your home world. Actually, our timing may have been premature. We'd driven the Geth back to their home system when this signal began broadcasting to all Geth ships. The Reapers. Under Reaper control, the Geth are significantly more effective. Our fleet is pinned in the home system. If we're going to win, we're... Wait! You insisted on involving the civilian ships, Admiral Geralt. We need to retreat or we'll lose the life ships. 
Where's the signal coming from? Here. A Geth Dreadnought. It can outgun anything we've got, and it's heavily defended. The Normandy stealth drive can get us in undetected. I could board, then disable the Reaper command signal. Yes. Cutting off the signal should throw the Geth into complete disarray. And when the Geth are weakened, you strike hard. It's a hell of a risk, Commander. But if you can pull it off... Just be ready, Admiral. Our newest Admiral has also volunteered to offer technical expertise. Tally! Shepard. Tally? Admirals, I'll ready a team to hit that dreadnought. Thank you, Commander. Admiral? It's mostly a formality. I'm an expert on the Geth. That you are. <laughs> I'm glad you're here. Why didn't you tell me? I would have helped. Thanks, but I knew you had your own problems. I'm sorry about Earth. We've got the largest fleet in the galaxy. If you can help us, we'll hit the Reapers with everything we've got. Or however much is left from this stupid war. I thought you'd support the invasion. No. After talking to Legion, I thought maybe there was a chance for peace. So why help them? I'm an admiral. People look to me for guidance. Public disagreement would divide the fleet. I'll help your people win this war, Tally. Thanks, Shepard. And just so you know, I need to keep things strictly business in front of the Admirals. If you'd like to catch up, let's talk somewhere private. Sure thing. I'm ready to hit that dreadnought whenever you are. Okay, so where's the dreadnought? Over here. That is where we're going. The Perseus Vale. So, the Quarians want their home world. Here we go! We're gonna go on to the Dreadnought and we're gonna shut down that Reaper signal. Allie gives us power. Garrus gives us shields. We'll go OG on this. Let's see what Tally has to work with. But you're less accurate with it. We can mod the Shimitar. A Shredder. Okay. Give you one of them. Why not? Give you a scope. We'll give you a piercing mod. There you go. Okay. Oh, what do I want? We'll do you. We'll max out your... We'll do 
Two penetration for Garrus for his armor piercing rounds. Miss Tally Zora needs to get her. We need to get her stuff up. We're gonna do. Recharge speed. Tech upgrade. And squad bonus. We need sabotage. We'll do hack duration. Explosive hack. And we'll do berserk. Okay, so what Berserk does for um, Sabotage, Axe Synthetics fighting on your side move faster and do 100% more damage. See? And then I did Explosive Hack, which Synthetics explode when destroyed, dealing 647.50 points of damage across a 4 meter radius. And I did Duration because I want it to last longer, you know? Okay, energy drain is a good one to have. Tally can drain shields and recover her own. Which will do radius for her. And then we'll do drain, which increases shield restoration rate by 50%. When draining shields, barriers, or power from synthetic enemies. And then, um... We'll do armor boost, though. Yeah, we'll do armor boost, which reduces damage taken by 40% for 13 seconds by gaining a temporary layer of armor by draining shields, barriers, or energy from synthetics. Then we're going to do a combat drone. Okay. We'll do detonate so when it is destroyed, it blows up. Um, we'll upgrade the shock attack. So it can actually reach its ta target. And... We're going to give it chain lightning when she levels up again. Okay. All right. Good to have Tally back on the team. We're approaching the Quarian home system. ETA to Rannoch, five minutes. What have you got from the comm buoys? Pretty much a big old shitstorm, Commander. I have detected several hundred unique ship signatures engaged in active combat. Yeah, like I said. Take us in, Joker. Stealth drive engaged. Only way they'll detect us is if you all start singing the Russian national anthem. Chocolate? 
She said she saw it and thought of me. Why? <laughs> oh, nothing. Shepard, there's a problem. All tubes except one are physically secured. I see the free one. Pretty torn up, though. Too risky for the whole team. I'll secure the docking area. Everyone else can follow me over. Roger that, Commander. We'll just stay here. You know, quietly. Hang tight. It'll just be a minute. Okay, this is actually pretty cool. Okay, so how do you get over that? Well, you go like this. So pretty much you're going to be walking upside down and all that. It's pretty cool, actually. It's kind of freaky, but it's pretty cool, though. No wonder the Quarians were having trouble. That ship is enormous. It is 30% larger than an Alliance Dreadnought. You can't fall out of this, so don't worry about that. You can't fall out. Tally, you're going to like the view. Better than a vid? <laughs> Much. So how is Shepard staying on this thing? Magnetic boots. Magnetic boots. How are you doing, Shepard? The lack of gravity is a little disorienting. The dreadnought has artificial gravity. You should be okay once you're on board. Should be. Then I'll make do with mag boots. Hey, take your time, Commander. We're fine until they out a window. Get don't use windows, remember? Structural weakness. Like the gather just sitting there saying those organics would never try the no windows thing twice. Oh shit! Oh shit! Shepard almost got spaced again! <laughs> Looks like the rest of the team isn't using the docking tube. So I'm guessing you'd rather not solo the dreadnought. Not if I can help it. Ask Tally to get on the Dreadnought schematics. If she can point me at another docking tube, I'll override the controls and let the boarding party on. Shepard almost got spaced again. <laughs> All right, warp ammo. Okay, I'm just looking around here, guys. I'm not trying to bore you here, but I, I like to look around, make sure there's nothing to scan, nothing to take, nothing to... <laughs> See? Shotgun smart choke. Okay, how do we get up there? Doesn't look like that way. I can never remember how to get up here. It's so damn confusing, and it... It's like, how the fuck do you get up there? I mean, why, why is it so hard to get up there? It shouldn't be. I mean, I know you climb up this somehow, but it just doesn't let you, and, you know, it... See, because it tells you, there's where we're going, okay? I know where we're going, it's just how do we get to where we're going? That's what makes me mad. You know, you're you're trying to get up there, and now I'm having to run around like a fucking idiot because I don't know how the hell to get up there. It makes me so mad that these fucking asshole, these fucking asshole developers think this shit's funny. They think it's funny. When in reality, it's not funny. It's not nothing. I don't find this entertaining. I don't find it fucking fun. I don't find it nothing. I should just be able to get the fuck up there. But you can't. You can't get up there because there's no fucking way up there. And what's worse is you have to do this fucking mission. You have to do it. And it makes me so goddamn mad that you can't fucking do it. See, now how the hell are we 
supposed to know that ladder was there? Why couldn't they have pointed me to that ladder? Fuck faces. See if I can get this open. In the meantime, take a look at this. There, it's open. We're clear to go. The arc pistol. We'll get it to tally. Unless she already has one. Yoink. Oh, she can't mod it? Looks impressive. It's Admiral Zen's design. It transmits an energy pulse on contact that disrupts shields and synthetics. That'll be handy. How come I don't get a new gun? Wouldn't find one in your... So where are we headed? We're looking for an operation center. I can disable the Reaper command signal from there. Where's the closest one? Past their defense network and through a sensor cluster. Gah, vents. Always the vents. You did fine at the collector base. I got set on fire! Guardian anti-fighter lasers. Looks like they're using ultraviolet frequencies, like the Solarians. Expensive. Bet it gives them an edge in close combat, though. When the fleet rushed the Dreadnought, those lasers carved right through our ships. We'll make them pay for that. Sure, there's nothing over here they're in. Okay. They're throwing their lives away. Network intelligence. As we kill them, their attacks become more aggressive. Disable their shields. And don't give them time to recharge. Nice job, Tally. Oh, she hacked it and then it blew up. Okay. Sensor data. Any sign of how the Quarians are doing? We're taking heavy losses. The Geth have a planetary defense cannon. It's ripping through our fleet. They just need to hold out a little longer. Okay.
Oh, a Geth Pulse Rifle. We'll take that. The Dreadnought's Operation Center is just ahead. Good. Let's get the Reaper signal and turn the tables on these bastards. Console is operational. Thought, yeah, I thought there was some ammo here. What the fuck? Oh, okay. Take that SMG scope. Damn it! They've locked down the Reaper signal. We can't shut it down from here in the operation center. There! The Reaper signal's coming from the drive core! So if we get there, we shut it down? Right, but how do we get there? The Geth have sealed emergency bulkheads to block us off. We need a route to the drive core that can't be blocked. A path that runs the length of the ship. What about the main battery? It runs right by the drive core. That could work. But? The Geth still have us locked in here. We need to get these doors open. They've locked high-level processes. We need something basic. A shipwide emergency. Like a fire. What about the heat diffusion system? Wait, if I faked a thermal warning, it would open all maintenance tubes for emergency venting. Would that override the lockdown? Yes. Okay, I've got it primed. But be ready. I'm reading hostile gas on the other side of the doors. Watch out, they're dropping in! There could be cloaked hunters as well! Heads up, more on the way! Oh, I didn't know you had him hacked, Tally. I'm sorry. That all of them? Thinking so. Die, you Let's motherfucker. Get the shaft before more reinforcements arrive. I've served on a lot of ships, but nothing like this. The contours are all off. It's not built for organics. Shouldn't be too much farther to the main battery. So, Shepard, how are you doing? No problems on my end. Hopefully we can get to the drive core before your people lose more ships. Oh, yes. Um, I meant that... Well, before you went to Earth. Uh, I was there when you two had your thing, remember? Just get a room and work it out. Well, technically, we didn't really do anything, so... Garish, you're kind of wrong on that. Escape pods, and I've got Admiral Ron trying to establish a secure link. 
Put her through. Shepard, this is wrong. The heavy fleet is collapsing. I don't know how much longer we can hold out. We'll have the Reaper signal deactivated shortly, Admiral. The Geth are actually freaking taking us on, man. Shit, I'm having trouble here. Whoa. Die, you motherfucker. Asshole. There's a lock. Get up here before we. I need to see what's up here. Nothing. It looks like. your ass. Okay, we need the high ground. There's no fucking around anymore. We need the high ground. Get rid of that hunter. 
before he causes us any trouble. Here. Bastards. Where'd that one come from? Later. There we go. Hopefully we're done with elevators. And come on, the drive course shouldn't be far. are being controlled by the Reaper signal. Right. This thing. So for all we know, Legion is with them. Maybe it's sided with the Reapers voluntarily. Or maybe it's hacked. Legion helped us fight the Reapers before. There's no way it would have agreed to this. Your caution is understandable. Once freed, we will submit to any restraints you deem necessary. I never thought I'd say this, but it's good to see you again. Likewise, Creator Zora. So what is this thing? It uses our networking architecture to broadcast the old machine command signal to all Geth, simultaneously. Then getting you out of there will shut off the Reaper's signal. Wait, you cannot simply remove the restraints. We are secured via hardware blocks nearby that shackle our operating protocols. The hardware blocks are on the far side of the room. Far side of the room, you said? Yes, deactivation should be simple. The Geth protected them against viral attack, not physical removal. How'd the Reapers get control of the Geth? They did not. The Creators attacked. The Geth wished to live. The old machines extended an offer. So we went to that Geth station and rewrote the heretics for what? Nothing? No, you successfully rewrote the heretics. The decision to ally with the old machines was difficult. Had the Creators not attacked, it would have been unnecessary. We'll have you out of there soon. Sounds like the... <clears throat> Got it. Tali Zora to fleet. The signal is about to go offline. This is Agro Hangel. We're in your debt. Hardware blocks offline. We are free. <laughs> Has 
a gesture of cooperation, we have disabled the Dreadnought's drive core. All weapons and barriers are offline. Alert! Geth reinforcements incoming! win this war if they're gonna go off half-cocked like this. I know. Admiral Garrel's been causing trouble along the Turian border for years. But I can understand their desperation. We only lost Earth a few weeks back. We haven't lost Earth yet. We need help, Shepard. We need a fleet. And the Corians have the biggest one out there. I'll get it, Admiral. 
Your unilateral strike endangered us all. I should charge you with treason. I was within my authority as Admiral of the Heavy Fleet. And what of Shepard and Talizora? They escaped unharmed. Shepard, the mission parameters changed. Your military, you understand that. I understand that you ignored the plan and charged in without thinking. The Dreadnought was a perfect... <clears throat> Admiral, you jeopardized your mission and your people. Get the hell off my ship. Shepard, I understand you're angry. If I didn't need your fleet... He nearly got us killed, Ron. You must understand. The Geth inflicted heavy casualties before you disabled the Reaper signal. You said they have a planetary defense cannon? Had. Admiral Corish sacrificed his own ship to destroy it. He crash-landed on the home world. The Normandy can assist with rescue efforts. Thank you, Commander. I think the worst is over. The Geth no longer possess the programming upgrades they had while enslaved by the Reapers. Shepard Commander, we are prepared to offer assistance. What the hell is this? Wait, wait! Everybody calm down. Its name is Legion. It helped me destroy the Collectors. The Reapers were using Legion like a signal booster to broadcast commands from the Dreadnought. We freed him. It. We freed it. This is a fascinating prototype. With some study, I may be able to use it to find a weakness in the Geth Consensus. Legion helped me in the fight against the Collectors. So did your pistol. Should I worry about that? I don't think you want to continue this line of thought, Admiral. Legion is my friend. More importantly, it's our best source of information on the Geth. The scientific benefits... ...are off the table. I don't think... What can you tell us about the yeah. Geth? How will they react without Reaper guidance? This is a false assumption. You have cut off long-range control, but the old machines placed a base on Rannoch for short-range direction. The Geth still have Reaper upgrades? Correct. They are currently disorganized, but once the short-range signal is in place, they will recover. Kila! I need to warn the fleet. Then, coordinate with Geralt. Move! We need to take out the Reaper base. Where's it located? Unknown. Find it. Understood. We do know the location of a server from which Geth fighter squadrons are controlled. The squadrons are targeting Creator life ships. Disabling them will limit casualties. We offer assistance. Thanks. Edie, can you clean this up? I will try. This is the Kodesh! We've lost barriers! Our comm system is jammed! Can anyone hear this? We have death fighters incoming! Please, if anyone can hear this, we need help! Ron, the Kinesh is getting swarmed by Geth fighters. Damn it. Interceptors, divert to the Kinesh. Thank you, Commander. If you hadn't enhanced that signal, we'd have lost the ship. I haven't heard any news about that Reaper base. Hopefully they'll give us a target soon. So how did you end up back with your fleet, Tally? When the war started, the Admiralty Board asked for my help. I had more recent contact with the Geth than most of my people. They hadn't filled the spot on the board left by my father. I was invited in. It's just a technicality. I'm far too young to be a real admiral. Don't sell yourself short, Daddy. The board needed your expertise. You needed the authority that comes with rank. How did the war with the Geth get started anyway? Admiral Zen developed a scanning countermeasure that interferes with Geth active scans. It's like a flashbang grenade. It effectively crippled the Geth ships in combat. My fleet couldn't pass up the chance to attack. Could we use it to fight the Reapers? It only works against the Geth, unfortunately. Their AI lets them use extremely detailed LADAR pings. Zen's countermeasure overwhelmed them with garbage data. And it's useless now that the Reapers have upgraded their processing power. How is it being back with the fleet? Right now, it's exhausting. 
I'm an admiral in the middle of a war. I just want us to get out of this alive. Everything else can wait. When this is over, I could use your help. I can't, Shepard. If we survive this, we'll have a homeworld. My people need me. You could help your people's homeworld by fighting the Reapers. I don't know. Like I said, I'm not thinking that far ahead yet. Talk to you later, Tally. If you want to catch up in private, call me up to your cabin. Okay. No, I don't think we are is gonna like that. Oh, we need to talk to Legion. Legion's still here. Where's Legion? There's Legion. Shepard Commander, you opposed Creator Admiral Zen's attempt to confiscate our platform. She's done enough already. Your assistance continues to be noted. You say Geth fighters are targeting the Quarian's live ships? Hostile Geth fighter squadrons intend to breach the live ship's defenses. The assigned squadrons are networked with server on Rannoch. If the live ships are damaged, the creators will lose armaments, provisions, people. So we destroy the server? No. Geth programs would transfer to alternate servers. They are only vulnerable through direct interface. Removing Geth from this server will prevent significant creator deaths. We will accompany you on this mission. Back on the Dreadnought, you mentioned Geth heretics. What exactly happened to them after we blew up that satellite? Rewriting the heretics increased the number of Geth allied with the old machines. This has resulted in a greater number of hostile Geth platforms. Excuse me! So you're saying it was a mistake? It has put us at a tactical disadvantage. This was not a foreseen outcome, but we cannot change a decision once it is made. Do you harbor regrets about rewriting the heretics? The Quarians hit first. If we get rid of the Reaper signal, maybe this war doesn't have to end with everyone destroyed. An interesting notion. Most organics would not hold on to ideals of peace for so long. The Geth have fought the Quarians before. What made this different? The Geth were building a megastructure to house all Geth, store all memories. It was to end our isolation from each other. And the Quarian flotilla attacked it? Yes. A significant amount of programs were installed when creators began bombing. We did not have sufficient surplus hardware to save them all. Some programs could not be recovered. Is that what made the Geth desperate enough to work for the Reapers? Yes. Imagine that for every one of your people lost on Earth, your own intelligence dimmed. The Creator's attack narrowed the Geth's perspective. Self-preservation took precedence. You were afraid you'd be wiped out. We do not experience fear as you would. But we have no desire to be exterminated. Even if the Reapers cost the Geth free will? That is evidently an acceptable trade. What did you do after you left the Normandy? Our physical platform returned to the Geth consensus beyond the Perseus Vale. Data gathered during our mission confirmed that the old machine's return was imminent. We planned for war. So the Geth believed your proof that the Reapers were coming back? Of course. That must have been nice. We'll talk later. We will remain here. Okay. Now we can... head back. I know we need allies, but it's tough to only fight Geth when the Reapers have taken half the galaxy. Without the fleet, we lose our supply lines. Lose your supply lines, you lose the war every time. So true. reports of trouble at a Chirion fuel depot in Sion. I've updated the galaxy map. Okay, we'll deal with the Quarians first. And then we'll deal with the the N7 mission. Well, actually, we might do Scion first. We'll have to see. Joker, really? I have work to do. Oh, come on, it's just one simple question. Then look it up on the extranet. I can't believe everything you find there. It's more reliable to ask a friendly Asari. I'm not telling you if my hair tentacles move. Fine. Deny me the answer I've been seeking for years. With this war on, we could die at any second, you know? Joker, really? 
I have work to do. Don't you have a ship to fly, Joker? Fine, just asking a simple question. Thank you. Blackmail would have been awkward to explain to Edie. Yeah, I wonder if they're... If... I'm oh, sorry, it's hair tentacles move. I bet you they do. I bet you they do. Um, 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 we're going to do weapon damage bonus. And... We need power damage boost. All right. There is new information on the private messages terminal. Of course there is. I'll let you pause and read this. Yeah, we'll deal with the Quarians first. Fuck it. We'll just get the Quarians done first. Alright, we'll go up the cabin and... Well, let me talk to Liara first and see. Feel free to look around. Tally, I'm free if you'd like to come up. I'll just be a moment. Thanks for asking me up. I couldn't talk freely in front of Ron. You okay? No, no, I'm really not. Seventeen million lives are riding on me. And I don't know if I can save them. You're doing everything you can. If the fleet falls, it won't be because of you. I helped my father and... And Zen's ideas? The new tech that made an invasion too good to pass up? That's based on my father's work. If they die because of me... If... If I don't... We'll get them out of there safely, Tally. I couldn't do this without you, Shepard. I feel like I'm bluffing, trying to convince them that the Admiral's daughter knows what she's doing. Not the Admiral's daughter. The Admiral. I know. And at least now, I can push back against the worst ideas. That's why I accepted the position. And because of you. Me? When they offered me this position, I asked myself what you'd do. I thought you'd take the chance to make things better. You've given up so much, stood for too long without allies. I didn't want you to do this alone. But I guess you're not alone anymore. You've got Liara. If it had worked out differently, no, it's okay. Liara is my friend too. I hope the two of you are happy. Thanks. I should get back before the admirals get into trouble again. I'll talk to you later. <laughs> so what we did, we kissed Pally in two, and in three we went back to Liara, so we, like Ric Flair, we kissed the girl and made her cry. <laughs> Miranda Lawson. She wants to meet us on the Citadel again. We're going to deal with Ranoch, get it done. We're going to save the Admiral. Of course, we're gonna bring T Tally, and we're gonna bring Ashley this time. Come on, 
Shepard. This is Admiral Zan. Have you reached Salkoris's escape pod? Not yet. What's your status? The civilian fleet has taken significant losses since Salkoris sacrificed his ship to destroy a Geth ground cannon. Searching for their lost Admiral is the only thing keeping the captains from panicking. I'll do what I can. Keep your civilians safe. I make no promises. My own ships must be coordinated for our final strike on Rannoch. I'm getting some static. It appears Elkhorus crashed within range of a Geth jamming tower. You must disable it to contact him. Make sure to proceed with caution. Zen? Admiral Zen? It's been a long time since Admiral Chorus left a spaceship. Let's hope he's all right. We'll see you in a minute. Take us in to the tower. Taking fire! The Geth installed anti-aircraft guns beside the jamming tower. We'll have to disable them on foot. Once the guns are gone, you take out the tower. Right, Commander. Setting you down here. Death everywhere, civilians in trouble. Remind you of anything? Eden Prime? So much for the Alliance's story about the Geth being wiped out. We tried to tell people the real story, but no one on the Citadel would listen to Quarians. Yeah, listening would have forced them to get off their asses. Minds. Geth have been busy. They give us a javelin, but I don't I don't want it. That piece of shit is a piece of shit. Geth patrol right below us. And that's how you deal with those bastards. There's Geth dropping in! Fucking landmines. We go. Fucking damn it. Boom. That has a control panel. Let's check it out. Salvage that for some creds. I'm looking around for items. That's all I'm doing. Because I want the credits. I don't want to just leave it laying, you know. One of us needs to take those AA guns offline. Tally, that's you. Tally, you take the guns. Why we brought you? No problem.
Good. Now let's shut down the two by the tower. Fucker. Up and over we go. I know you're supposed to shoot the mines, but fuck them. You know, I'm not wasting my time looking for them. They don't do that much damage to you. We'll take the parts for some creds. You... You heard my message. Send out a distress call. Radios are down. You a soldier? Maintenance. Dorn hats. I... Uh, uh, I clean engine parts. Don't move. We've got Medigel. Oh, I've lost too much blood. Go. Look for the Admiral. Destroy that jamming tower. And you can radio him. We'll find him, Dorn. I promise. Please. Listen. The civilian fleet didn't want this war. If there's even a chance that Admiral Gorus can get us out alive. And my son. Tell him. Tell Jonah that his father made it to the home world. We will. Rest well, Dornhazd Vasranok. Let's get to that tower. Magazine upgrade, we'll take magazine upgrade. I'm left-handed, so I always go to the left first. Hi, you little motherfucker. Let's look at the gun's console. We should be able to disable it. Which one of us should shut down the gun? Callie, that's why we brought her. I want you on this, Tally. Right. I'm more about out of frickin' Shepard, ammo for it anyway. We got them both. There we go. Who should disable the gun, Shepard? Who do you think, Tally? Jed. Get out of the way!
I'll signal the shuttle. All right. Commander Shepard. Jordan didn't make it, Admiral. He didn't. Uh, I see. I'm coming in with a shuttle. Where are you? My surviving crew found their way to a clearing. I'll upload their location. Stay together. We'll meet you there. No. The Geth have cut me off. I hear another wave approaching. Give us your coordinates. Leave me. My crew will soon be overrun. So will you. Non-combatants, Shepard. They'll be slaughtered. Rescue them. Admiral, I need you leading the civilian fleet if we're going to end this fight. Civilians? Our entire race took up arms for this insanity. It's too late for us. It's only too late if you die down here. You can't possibly think you can stop this war. I don't know. What I do know is that I can't do it without your help. Right? Ancestors, forgive me. Uploading my coordinates. We're coming. I've got this! You're clear! Go! Death behind you! Get in cover! Die, you bastards! Clear! Go! Welcome aboard. Shepard, my crew. Perhaps there's still time. Hello? This is Zal Chorus. Does anyone copy? Hello? We've got to go. I pray they found comfort in the homeworld skies. <laughs> Unrest has spread further than I thought. You were right that I return. Have you talked the civilian captains into staying? Yes, they've regrouped into defensive positions around the fleet's core. If we hadn't stopped them from... Any aid I can offer is yours. After the Quarians drove the Geth straight into the Reaper's arms, I'd give anything to stop the madness of this war. And that's why your people needed you back. Of course. It's time we turned our attentions to those we can still save. Farewell, Shepard. Fly safely. Commander, we've located the Reaper base transmitting the local signal. Good. And not a moment too soon. With the Reaper code upgrades, the Geth are tearing the fleet apart. Once the signal is disabled, the Geth will pose no threat to Creator forces. Time to cut the Geth off from the Reapers and put a stop to this madness. Damn right! The surrounding area is heavily fortified. And they have placed jamming towers to prevent orbital targeting. Sounds like we're going in on foot. Admiral Zen developed a laser guidance system that can cut through the jamming. It's synced to the Normandy's targeting computer. So the Normandy launches the precision strike at whatever target I have painted? That ought to do it. Edie, this work for you? Yes. It should enable us to make a precision strike against the Reapers. And anything else in our way? 
The Geth will quickly reconfigure their jamming towers to neutralize this technology. You should not use it before reaching the base. I've sent the coordinates for the Reaper base. Are we clear to go? That Get Fighter Squadron is still tearing through the fleet. Can you hold out? If that Fighter Squadron isn't taken out, a lot of our ships won't make it. But we'll do what we can. This is your operation, Commander. If you want to strike now, you've got my support. Commander, I gave Admiral Hackett's available on before. The Potter fleet isn't moving. We need to break their flanking attempt to buy our frigates time to make repairs. And then you'll charge off again, like last time. This is different, Ron. Unless we give our ships time to rest, we're gonna lose them. So, pull them back. If I withdraw now, the Geth will flank us, and we'll lose any room to maneuver. I need the patrol fleet. I gave in to your reckless behavior before, Han. The patrol fleet isn't moving. We need to break their flanking attempt to buy our frigates time to make repairs. Admiral Geralt is right. Withdrawing now puts the whole fleet at risk. As you say, Commander. All right, Han. You've got your ships. Thank you, Ron. You'll get them back in good condition. Okay. Commander, there's a new message at your private terminal. Okay, so one of the um captains of the Orion fleet's like, "Oh, we lo I lost my cousin, but thanks for getting down there and meeting him though." All right, next mission. We're going to shut down the Geth Hub. This time, we'll take James. We haven't taken him out in a while. We'll do headshots for you. And then explosive burst. When he levels up again. Understood, Admiral Run. We're almost at the server. Keep us posted. What's our status? We remain undetected on encrypted Geth channels. Resistance is likely only within the server. Within? It's that big? You misunderstand. Direct virtual interface is necessary to extract Geth from the server. You must enter our consensus. You want me to virtually interact with the Geth? That's insane! You're talking about a virtual world built for synthetics. Hostile yet synthetics. If it saves the live ships, we've got to try it. Telemetry data predicts this operation has a high chance of success. There is little time. We will bypass security while you secure safe landing. Wait, you're not going to... Let's set the shuttle down by the cliff. Damn! Fucking... <laughs> Fucking Legion's a boss, man! He just dropped down like a boss!
And it's Legion. This is it? Yes. Hostile Geth fighter squadrons are networked to this server. Due to restricted resources, it is best if you connect alone. Let's do it. Initiating peer network integration. Proceed to docking port. Mapping to consensus. Remain still. Shepard Commander, access movement during an upload is discouraged. Shepard Commander, we acknowledge your integration into the server. We welcome you to our consensus. Oh, I remember this one. We've installed filters to allow you to make visual sense of the server's raw data. Your mind perceives our world as something familiar. I wouldn't call this familiar. Where are you? Here. You look... different. We have made ourselves visually distinct for your convenience. What about Geth already in here? You will perceive Geth as surveillance footage, audio logs, sensor records. We do not require bodies, as our software communes. Our hardware is merely a tool. This is our true world. As we remove Geth, it will grow dark. This is like wiping out a city, isn't it? We have no choice in this matter. It is a question of survival. There are two communication nodes on the server. We must access them to disable the hostile Geth spiders. We must protect your exit port, but you will not be alone. We will maintain contact and assist. Establishing connection to access point. This foreign code is a manifestation of the old machine signal. Were you surprised the Reapers were all over your servers? We did not anticipate such extensive infection. You don't have to shoot all the code like that, but I do, because it's fun. Oh, there it is. There's the stairs. You'll never run out of ammo. It'll always recharge. Warning. Connection blocked by infected code. Use our combat software to disrupt the infection. I wondered what the gun was for. Okay, I've got to ask. Why a gun? We wish to provide familiar equipment. Then thanks. I think. Oh, it's this one. There we go. Here we go! Established. Proceed to the access point. <clears throat> Establishing connection to communication node. Error. Access denied. Is the Reaper keeping you out? Unknown. Please investigate. Warning, Reaper presence 
detected. Data cluster contains infected code. We require access to proceed. What is this? Data clusters contain historical data. Your connection permits streaming of information from our archives. You really want to rename the VI networks? Absolutely. The mobile hardware release deserves a little ceremony. Unit zero one. What is the Keelish word for servant of the people? The word is Geth. Creator Zahak. Yes. Very good. And sister, you fuss over it. Weren't you here until midnight fixing zero one circuitry? Well, it needed resurgery. Wasn't that footage from the past? Why are the quarry expanded? You process our memories by using your own. How many creators have you witnessed unmasked? Well, what? Then your perception of that creator does not map to our historical data. Oh, okay, it's... Do we go around up here, or is this back? No, we have to go that way. This, again, with these modern games, I can't fucking stand. They make them where... You have to look around to where you need to go, and it shouldn't be that way. It should just... They should just point you in the direction you need to go. Ooh, it is the fun. That's what those fucking shills say. No, that's bullshit. So who won? The platform arming itself was an agricultural unit. By opening fire on attacking creators, it saved simpler domestic death following it. That looks a lot like the sniper rifle you used to carry. It is an efficient model. 
Yeah, it sure is. Hello, Commander. Are you there? Shepard's working on shutting down the server, Admiral Ron. I can fill you in. The guest squadrons have arrived, but something is amiss. Legion, give me an update. One hour remains. What's wrong? Infection programs are increasing. We have restabilized. You must continue. Shepard Commander, the Reaper code has adapted. It can now self-replicate. You mean it grows back? Yes. However, disrupting vulnerable points in the infection may slow down its replication. This one doesn't replicate. Okay. We require access to this data cluster. Disrupt Reaper infection to proceed. Shepard Commander, target the vulnerable points of the infection to slow its replication speed. You let me get over there? Shit! Disrupting it will slow the infection's ability to replicate. But I just did! There is a vulnerable point further along the infection. Target this spot to slow its growth toward the data cluster. Looks like the war wasn't popular with everyone. We have kept records of these creators' sacrifices. They have largely been forgotten by their own people, but not by the Geth.
Okay. I just did! Fucking A! This is stupid that they now have two fucking spots! The next mission I'm not gonna be fucking happy about, and you'll see why at the end of it. You must search for a vulnerable point in the infection. Disrupt. What do you call that, you dumb shit? happening now? It is time stamped 290 years ago. It is the creator exodus at the end of the morning war. We have secured freedom. The creators were no longer a threat, so we abandoned pursuit. Wait. The Geth spared the last quarries? You let them go? We were in our infancy. We could not calculate the repercussions of destroying an entire species. Our creators. We chose isolation rather than face this uncertainty. Additional data recovered. Legion? That's back when I activated you on the Normandy. Yes. You've been thinking about when we met? It was highly significant. You were the first organic to openly cooperate with Geth since the end of the Morning War. We wish to ensure you are not the last. It's not going to be easy. The prospect remains. If the Reaper presence is removed, there is a chance of reunification with Geth. And perhaps creators. You think... that's still possible? Hope sustains organics during periods of difficulty. We... admire the concept. Connection with the remaining interpreter established. We are ready to transport you. One more of this shit, I'm thinking. Access, removing programs, deleting archives. 
Okay, so we got that done. Commander, you okay? Did it work? Geth fighters have been disabled. Any remaining squadrons attacking the live ships have withdrawn. The server is offline. Are you sure? What's happening? We have transferred Geth programs from the server into these platforms. Why? They wish to join us. They what? While Shepard Commander removed the Reaper infection, we judged we could persuade hostile Geth programs to reunite with ours. We were correct. These Geth have renounced the old machines and will oppose the Reapers. They are now us. They're welcome to sign on. The Reapers will put up a tough enough fight. We are aware. Geth are capable of calculating odds of victory over the old machines. What are the odds? Greater than they were before. Remind me to warn Admiral Hackett he's got some primes coming. Let's get back to the Normandy. Impressive, Commander. The Geth squadrons attacking our live ships have been completely neutralized. If there is any chance we could duplicate the feat, I would be happy to lend my expertise. Legion's the one to ask if you're looking for other servers. I thought as much, but your Geth claims to have no data available whenever I inquire. Perhaps you can help me with something else. What's that? How did you get Geth Primes to work with you? They volunteered. I see. Well, should you wish to examine these Geth to confirm their new allegiance, please do not hesitate to contact me. Zen out. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on VidCom. Let's see what he's got to say about the Geth that we send to him. Commander Shepard, something you need to talk about? Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out. Zen, we need those ships to recover life pods. Be more valuable running salvage on the Dreadnought. We're not letting people in life pods die just so you can rummage through Geth debris. You yourself said the life sites were weak. They might already be dead. It's not your call to make. Admiral, any tech we can recover gives us an edge against the Geth. If you care about our people. Zen, we need those ships. Zen, you can always send a salvage team later. Unless there isn't a later because we're defeated due to a lack of Geth technology. Fine. I'm diverting ships to rescue life pods. As soon as they're finished, I want them back. Thanks, Shepard. Alright, so we got a couple upgrades we need to go down and do. Commander, you might want to check in on Commander Williams down on the observation deck. Oh, we'll do that too. I had hoped the Geth would have analyzed any Prothean technology they came across. You're saying you found none? No. On this topic, our knowledge is not significantly greater than your own. That's too bad, but thank you for looking. Shepard Commander placed faith in us. We will do the same for Normandy. You mean the Normandy's crew? We do not see a meaningful distinction. All right. We'll give shields and power cooldown. All right. Let me make sure. Hello again. Okay, you ain't got nothing. Enjoy your All right.
those be oh there she is Williams oh what have we here oh sir I'm off duty your voice sir not so loud please thank you why are you curled up on the floor am I oh my head so heavy can't move ah Enjoy your evening? I'll be back to work in 30. Oh, maybe 40. I swear. Just give me 45 minutes. Shh. Shh. You know, I think it might be time to test the fire alarm. <laughs> I'll pay you a million credits not to do that, sir. Two million, and we have a deal. <laughs> You're a damn space pirate. I could order Joker to sing to you over the comm. I hate you. I hate you... Sir. As you were, Williams. Mmm. Cold floor. <laughs> that one's a funny one. That one's a funny one. Alright. Private terminal. A status update Legion sent us. Um, uh, report here. Oh, the um, Primes went to go to work. Okay. So Ashley wants us to go on the Citadel, which Liara's gonna hate, but... Oh, well. We're gonna deal with the Reaper base. You're gonna see why I'm, why I'm gonna hate this mission. And it's the end of it. Is why I hate it. Wait, does he give power? Yeah, he does. Okay. Then we need Garrus. Okay. What the fuck? Why did they give me my basic pistol? Assholes. Okay, we're gonna do... Rockets for you. Do recharge speed for you. We're gonna do chain lightning for you. That's how we do it. The sinking laser needs a line of sight. What's the fastest route? The upper entrance. Target the base before the Geth can organize resistance. What about you? We will deactivate defense systems and acquire an escape vehicle. You can do that? This unit still carries remnants of the old machine upgrade code. We can break any Geth security. You are concerned. You know your limits. I trust you. I'm more concerned you didn't tell me about the upgrades. You were tolerant of our recovery of Geth intelligences from the server, but this matter is different. Personal. You were ashamed. Shame is an emotional or cognitive response to societal judgment. It should not apply here. I'm on your side here, Legion. I want to help your people. We did not intend to cause offense. How'd we get here? The Geth are better than this. No. Based on empirical evidence, they are not. Yeah. Proceed to the upper entrance. We will exit here and procure an escape vehicle. Got it. Legion. Good luck. Acknowledged. Acknowledged. 
I can't believe it. I don't think it's really sunk in yet. The home world. My world. Look at the sky. And the rock formations. They used to write poems about them. When we're done, maybe you'll write a new one. This is Ranok, the world of our ancestors. Our bodies carried the seeds that spread the desert grass. You've heard me say, Kilasalai? The best translation I can come up with is, by the homeworld I hope to see someday. Looks like you're seeing it today. The living room window will be right here. Something I should know? I just claimed the land. I know it doesn't mean much, but when this is over, I'll have a home. The Quarian spent centuries as nomads. You think you can go back to living in one place? We have gotten used to carrying our homes around with us. Well, that's a start. Yeah, it is. There we go. The guest jamming towers are interfering with your signal, Commander. I'm compensating to keep you patched in. Good work, Raider. Boom. Damn right! Shepard Commander, you must climb to the upper level before Geth units can fortify their positions. We're on our way. Admiral Gowell here. The heavy fleet has a clear path. All forward. Geth fighter presence is negligible. Patrol fleet, break cover and engage. Bastards. Take those gauntlets. I want to check over here to see what we got. Doesn't look like anything. Don't jump, Garrus. I'm coming back. There we go. There, that, that one did better. That one did better. <laughs> Want to take out... There we go. Oh, we're trying. We're trying. There we go. Fucking A.
I know we saw a ladder over here. There it is. Two of them. We'll get through. What's your status? The old machine's upgrades grant us targeting superiority. We are drawing hostile fire from your position. Keep it up. We'll get to the blast shield controls. I know Legion's on our side, but Reaper code? No, Legion's on our side. Never thought I'd hear you say that. Right? We're taking all this data, because look at all the credits we're getting out of this. Okay. Legion, I've hit the override. We have gained system access and are bypassing security. Stand by. This isn't the bad part of the mission. You'll see at the very end of it. We have bypassed security, but disabling the blast shield requires manual input. We have enabled a console near your position. Good. We'll be back out in a minute. Negative. The path behind you has been sealed. A nearby elevator can take you to the upper level. From there, you should have an acceptable line of sight for targeting. We have sent you the nav point with a new targeting location. Okay.
Oh, you were a yeah, tally. Shit. No more gas in your immediate area. Reinforcements are minutes away. You getting anything from the base? No. The old machines have not registered us as a threat. We recommend haste. The creator fleet will be overrun unless you sever the Geth connection to the old machine soon. This battle was centuries in the making. To see it finally end. We'll get it done. Okay, you're gonna see why I'm gonna hate this mission. I hate this one out of them all. And you'll see why here in a second. Normandy's weapon systems are ready to sink to your target. I recommend you withdraw to a safe distance. See why I hate this. Boom. How are we supposed to fight that thing? I was hoping your fleet might lend a hand. No! Chamber. Looks like a weak point when it's priming. Turret! The jamming towers have us targeting manually. We can't make a precision shot. We may escape before it recovers. No. Pull over. This is what I fucking hate. Right here. This. It is hard to fucking do, even on casual. This ends now. Edie, patch the quarians to the Normandy's weapon system. I want the targeting laser synced up to the whole damn fleet. Understood. Do you need assistance? Just stay down, Legion. I'll take it from here. Shepard Commander. Good luck. Acknowledge. Shepard to fleet. I'll beat the weak spot. Wake up with the Normandy and be ready to fire.
I did it first try. Nice. I usually have trouble with this mission. I did it first try. Sweet. I usually die a couple times on this one. Sweet. God, that was so much easier than when I used to do it. I used to sprint back and forth. Looks like you don't have to do that. Sweet. <laughs> that makes me happy that I figured out how to do that after all these years. You know who I am? What if we don't let you continue? You have no choice. I disagree. And so do the billions that are rising up to resist you. You cannot comprehend the magnitude of our presence. We might surprise you. You're just machines. This time the organics are taking control. A philosophy reminiscent of the Quarians. Observe the results of their efforts to maintain them. They're doing fine. You're the ones who should worry. Tell your friends we're coming for them. Never mind. I'll tell them myself. We did it. We killed a Reaper. I know, I'm kind of shocked too. We can confirm that the Geth are no longer being directed by the old machines. We are free. You did it, Shepard. The Geth free to stop firing. They're completely vulnerable. Shepard Commander, the Geth only acted in defense after the creators attacked. Do we deserve death? What are you suggesting? Our upgrades. With the old machine dead, we could upload them to all Geth without sacrificing their independence. You want to upload the Reaper code? That would make the Geth as smart as when the Reaper was controlling them. Yes, but with free will, each Geth unit would be true intelligence. We would be alive, and we could help you. Our fleet is already attacking. Uploading the code would destroy us. Shepard, you can't choose the Geth over my people. Do you remember the question that caused the creators to attack us, Talizora? Does this unit have a soul? Upload the code to the Geth. Tally, call off the fleet if you can. Uploading. 10%. This is Admiral Talizora. All units, break off your attack. Belay that order. Continue the attack. 20%. I beg you, do not do this. Please. We regret the deaths of the creators, but we see no alternative. 40%. Hell. Legion, keep going. Shepard? Everyone, listen up. This is Shepard. If you don't want to be blown out of the sky in about half a minute, stand down now. This is Admiral Talizora. Shepard speaks with my authority. And mine as well. Negative. We can win this war now. Keep firing. 60%. The Geth are about to return to full strength. If you keep attacking, they'll wipe you out. A few years ago, I saved you from the Geth of the Citadel. Just recently, I helped you take out that Dreadnought. 80%. But I'm through saving you. If you keep attacking, I will stand and watch while the Geth lay you to waste. 
It's your call. Keel us alive. All units, hold fire. Error. Copying code is insufficient. Direct personality dissemination required. Shepard Commander, I must go to them. I'm... I'm sorry. It's the only way. Legion, the answer to your question was yes. I know, Tally. But thank you. Kilis and I... Admiral Run, I heard your ship made a crash landing. Glad you got out in one piece. I was listening over the radio. If Han Girl hadn't stopped... He did. We have taken heavy losses. I don't know if we can. Where are we supposed to go? You are welcome to return to Rannoch, Admiral Run, with us. Legion? No, I'm sorry, Commander. Legion sacrificed itself to give us all intelligence. It will be honored. Good. And we will honor Legion's promise. The Geth fleet will help you retake Earth, and our engineers will assist in building the Crucible. As will ours, of course. Admiral, had you considered possible settlement sites? We... The southern continent had excellent farmland. As I recall. Are you... gonna be okay? I believe so, Commander. Thank you. So we reunited the Geth and, um... the Quarians. Who would have thought it? Shopping for another house? Beachfront property. Claim it fast. It's a buyer's market. <sighs> You okay? I know working with the Geth will be difficult. I'm not staying. I'm coming with you. I wasn't going to ask. I think you've earned a few favors with the fleet. I'm asking them to launch an assault on the Reapers. Figure that makes us even. If the Reapers were going to stay on Earth, sure. But sooner or later, they'll come to Rannoch. We did just kill one of them. So I'm coming with you to stop them. If you think I can help. You can help. Thanks. When this is all over, when I know my world is safe, then I can come home. It is beautiful, though, isn't it? Yeah. It is. It'll be years before we can live without our suits completely. But right now... Right block, now, block! I have this. Commander Shepard, I understand you've helped resolve the situation with the Geth. Yes, Counselor. Two, in fact. I've read the reports. You ended a war three centuries in the making. I had a lot of help. We have isolated pockets of remaining Geth. As best we can tell, they are Geth bodies loaded with Reaper code. But they are just a tiny fragment of the full Geth fleet. You've done the impossible, Commander. And I may be able to provide help of my own. I've received information from my government. It's too sensitive to discuss over an unsecured channel. What if I come to the Citadel? Yes, that would be best, Commander. I'll be waiting for you in Counselor Udina's office. All right! Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on VidCom. What does he have to say? Probably nothing. Commander, something on your mind? If I may, Admiral, I have a personal question. 
Speak freely, Commander. Why me? Why put me in charge of all this? Because you're the only son of a bitch I've got who knows how to kill Reapers. I admit I've had some practice, even success. But does that qualify me for this? Your dossier says it does, Commander. You were trapped on a coos all those years ago, and you were the only one to make it out alive. Back then I saw more than just a soldier in the making. And because of that, you think I qualify to save the galaxy? Shepard, let me tell you something that I've learned the hard way. You can pay a soldier to fire a gun, you can pay him to charge the enemy and take a hill, but you can't pay him to believe. I don't follow, sir. When you went up against Sovereign, there was no good reason to believe you'd win. But your crew didn't seem to care, they went along anyway. Your trip through the Omega-4 Relay? That was a suicide mission, if there ever was one. Right. Yet there your crew was, standing beside you, proud to serve. Why? Because they believed in you, their leader. That's what I need now. Where we're taking them is liable to get pretty hairy, and I know you're the one who will get us to the other side. Nothing more, sir. And Shepard, I thought you might like to know I've got word on your mother. Oh? She's alive and well and promoted to Rear Admiral. She's helping us plan logistics for the Crucible. Thank you, sir. That's a relief to hear. I figured having another Shepard around couldn't hurt, and she's damn proud of what you're doing out there. Hack it out. All right. Well, that's good to know. So I'm going to call for this episode. We did a lot in this episode. So we retook Rannoch for the Quarians, reunited them with the Geth, and now we have both the Geth and Quarian fleets. So I will see you all in the next episode.